Welcome to the Fairy Dust Crafts Podcast. It is December 5th, which means it is day five of Vlogmas. Um, you just saw me make my coffee and open a couple of my uh, little advents for today. That bluebell stitch marker. Oh my god. Oh my god. Got here again. Isn't it just gorgeous? I think this will have to go on here. Because uh, right now I'm using these little stars. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of here. Um very hard to show. Oh, made in my cat. Um, yeah, they're kind of like hard to show. They're like little star-shaped stitch markers. Um, they're kind of, because they're pointy, they kind of like hurt my fingers a little bit when I use them. So I think I'm going to put this bluebell on my sock here. Um, by the way, if you're new here, welcome. Uh, if you're a regular subscriber, thank you for coming back. And thank you for celebrating uh, this darker season of the year with me. It's my most favorite time of year. I love uh, Advent, even if it's usually the busiest time of year, like all over. Um, I still really enjoy it and then same with January. Winter is my season. I'm a winter child. Although I was born in May, but um, I was born in mid-May and it snowed when I was born. So it's a sign. I love snow. I love the colder season. Um, I'm just getting carried away here, aren't I? I'm just... Um, it's been a pretty busy day. I've been uh, I've been at work all day today, and um, uh, yeah, I've been doing lots of things today. So I got home earlier and did like a super quick. I do this every day when I come home from work. I do just like a super quick sweep around the house. I like open the windows, got in some fresh air. Um, that is, I've been told, a very, like, European thing. Central European thing? I don't know. Um, but apparently the Germans do it, too. Uh, we like to let in fresh air a couple times a day. Um, it's good for the health. So, I did that and I do like a kind of like 10 minutes just like sweep around the house um which means I like put away some dishes if there's anything I put in a load of laundry um just like tidy up a little bit um and get my things ready for uh, the end of the day, which I haven't done yet. I thought I would, I'm so excited to like open all of my little advent calendars. So I thought I would do that first. And um, I got a couple things on my to-do list still for today. And I'm gonna sit and knit. Last night, um, you probably saw it. Yeah, you saw it in my um, post from yesterday. I only did one more repeat on my uh, Christmas Joy socks. So a repeat is like about this much, it's like not a lot, like a centimeter, a little over. Um, but I got another repeat done for this, um, hopefully more today. And during my lunch break today, this is my progress on this sock. I knit like, I think two rounds. I think that's about it. So still same progress with my um, 12 Days of Christmas socks. I couldn't decide last night if I wanted to work on this or on this. I want to get this done. So I have kind of like one sock done for the first week of uh, December. Um, first full week, I want to say. So it is only Tuesday. 
I have lots of time still. It's only Tuesday. What am I saying here? Um, but I also want a full pair of these done by the end of the week because on Sunday I'll be opening my second Advent Sunday um, sock set by a homespun house. So I was kind of torn and then I, um, I did pick up this guy. So that's what I did last night. Um was about it like everything else you saw all the progress and obviously like I did my um my advent calendar socks that's like the first thing I do when I pick up my knitting um it's only 10 rounds so like five rounds per sock um to put in my new color for today so today we have to open our ginger snap one still and it is the fifth so let me find this a red one number five just gonna open this up real quick it's so beautiful oh my god look at this it's like fluorescent pink and blue which i wonder so let me grab the last couple days here gotta make sure that I don't mix them up because I want to actually like keep them in order and knit them on order but this was yesterday's so this is today so yesterday uh four five and then three so we're kind of like going from blue purple to kind of like purpley uh pink i am very excited this is gonna be really really cool i almost wonder if these should be like so hmm maybe because i'm like way behind and i think i will i thought about this all day today so i asked uh you guys yesterday if i should pull out my uh, my throw my anthology throw and knit it in a smaller needle so either a 3.5 right now I'm using a four millimeter needle uh, which is the suggested needle for the for the throw and I'm not quite sure if I want to do 3.5 or maybe 3.75 I just feel like the four millimeter is a little too loose and I like just like a tiny bit of a tighter gauge like the tiniest little bit so I am not sure what to do or rather I, will, I wasn't sure what to do and then I've been thinking about this all day today I'm like oh shall I pull it out I really prefer a tighter gauge and you know what I think that answered my question if I do want if I keep thinking about it and really do want a tighter gauge I should just pull it out rather than like working more on it and then once I'm done maybe even regretting that I didn't use a smaller needle uh so I will be pulling that out in the next few days there's no rush I am um, absolutely in no rush with this project uh I want to get it right that's like the one thing and it is um I have it all planned and this is going to be my like 30 minutes of knitting for January or for the new year not January like the new year for like however long it takes me to finish this it's probably going to take me like in the better part of the year to be honest um but yeah so I think I answered my own question by thinking about it and by like humming and hawing over it um Sometimes you just got to sit with a thing. Yeah, so that's the plan. I finally have a plan. Um, maybe you need a sip of coffee so I can like focus. So. Okay, so we opened uh, the advents for December 5th. Um, I... I need to do some tidying up in this room. I haven't really spent much time in here in the last couple weeks or so. And whenever that happens, whenever I don't use this room very often, it turns into a catch-all. Um, so there's literally stuff 
everywhere. I've gotten a couple things in the mail and I have like, I'm starting to get like a couple Christmas presents and stuff ready and everything is just piling on my desk, which should not happen because I use my desk to like obviously to actually like work on things and to do my planning and everything and I also use it to wind my yarn so that's where I place my swift um and wind my yarn my my winder is actually like attached to the desk and I don't really take it off unless I really really have to um but it's kind of like tuck that it away so I don't really need to take it off so I think that's the plan for tonight I got a do a little sweep through um, and then I need to do some organizing because I haven't done that in a while. I like using a planner. Uh, I'm a list and make plans kind of person. So I have to do that and we're having a staff meeting at the end of the week. So I gotta work on that. Um, I prepare a couple of classes have not done that yet uh for the end of the week but i feel like once it's wednesday so tomorrow it's kind of like the week just seems to disappear so uh, gotta do that gotta work on that but i also want to knit i just wanna do you guys ever get that where you just want to sit and knit and sip a hot beverage, have a nice hot tea, light a candle, and just enjoy yourself. And, you know, you know, I'm blabbering. I should not blabber. Um, I get carried away sometimes. I like to say my train of thought just derails and then I'm all over the place. That happens. Um, it brings out a lot of creativity in me though. So I have lots and lots of ideas. Um, before I get carried away even more, I'm going to say you guys have a good night, um, or day or whenever you're watching this, I'm gonna do some editing and I'm gonna do some cleaning and tidy up and then I will sit and knit. Thank you all for watching and checking in here. Uh, it's a pleasure being here and showing you um all the yarny things on a daily uh this month and have a wonderful night or day or whenever you're watching bye